of the uh, it's the all purple uh, box logo hoodie. Um, this time, this is the first Union House order I've got where they've sent me out a bag. So this is the Union House bag, and this is a legit bag. Like this is one that I got legit from the store. Um, only difference I can see is with the handle right there. This one's smaller, um, and the logo is pretty much the same size. I mean, they look pretty much the same. Um, the same kind of like thick plastic. This one's a little bit of a thicker plastic. But yeah, I mean, store bag, can't fucking complain with that shit. Uh, but yeah, let's get into the uh, actual fucking, there we go. Let's get into the actual review. Okay. So on the inside, let's have a look at the tag right here. Let's get this focused. Okay. This is not focusing. There we go. Pretty good tag. It's got on the back as well. Everything. Okay. Um, this is a nice, like, this is a, this fleece feels a little bit thicker than the last black box logo I got. More of like a winter uh, fleece material. Um, a little bit heavier. A little bit thicker. Um, all the stitching seems to be good. I mean, there's a few little loose stitchings, but, you know, you just rub those off and it's not really a problem. Um, I think it needs washed once just to kind of get rid of all the, like, debris and, like, extra threads and stuff. Um, I want to get a close-up of the box logo, however, because you can see there's a few imperfections, like, right, let's see how close I can get, yeah, you see, there's a thread in right there, and on the E, there's a little bit of a problem with the E right there, yeah. So, the box logo is pretty good. It doesn't have any floating E, which is good. I mean, the box logo looks good from, you know, like, nobody's going to really notice this from a distance. I mean, you could take, like, you could take a pen and, like, fill that in. Like a purple Sharpie or something. and Or you could even get, like, uh, nail clippers and, and fix that yourself. Like, no problem, but yeah. Um, drawstrings on this one are uh, very long i think this is the longest i've ever had a uh, drawstring from a union high city but yeah it's not really a problem you just cut them right there that's the correct length is you know you just uh you really got to look at pictures um look at pictures uh of box logo hoodies with people wearing them okay check yours and cut it while you're wearing it because if you cut it when you're not wearing the hoodie you'll put it on and they'll be too short so make sure you got to tie it off first then cut it and then uh you know you you, you basically you, you get the, the drawstrings okay it's pretty simple um sleeves cuffs good cuffs um i'll be doing a fitting of this one um to be honest this one fits a little bit bigger this one fits more like a large i'm not sure why but um it is a medium i'll show the inside tags right quick um yeah it shows let's see tags stitching's all good from uh from this side there's a little teeny bit of over stitching right there but you're not really going to notice that medium made in china and you got your you got your ones right there okay um yeah i mean to be honest the color uh looks a little bit different on the camera but yeah, it's a pretty nice color. It's a little bit darker in person. Um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. Um, I got this just to kind of wear underneath like a, like a, like a, for the winter, just to wear like underneath like a bomber jacket or something like that. So, um, yeah. Oh, and this tag right here. Let's have a look. Let's zoom. Focus. Yeah, good tag right there. Matches the color of the box logo, or the color of the hoodie, obviously. Um, yeah, there's not really much more to show. It's got the, you know, the different side panels and shit. It's a bit sweet. It's good. So, yeah. Um, there you go. Purple one. I'm guessing the red one is pretty much exactly the same as this, except red. Um, to be honest, if you're kind of 50-50, red versus purple... I would maybe pick up the red one because, uh, just because I guess they kind of messed up a little bit on the purple box logo, but still a great hoodie. And again, that little imperfection right there can be fixed. 
and you can't even notice it really from a distance. Um, so yeah, that's the purple box logo. Um, I've also got the uh, camo, um, you know, this, this one, the camo, uh, what's it called? The camo, uh, fucking Jesus Christ, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh yeah, the camo uh, crew neck. I've got that wearing it right now. It's uh this is dope. This is like awesome. Um I'd recommend it. I might do a review on it, I might not, I'm not sure. I probably will. Um so uh I'll probably upload that within the next couple of days. But yeah, like I said, this one fits a little bit bigger than the other ones. Um I'm kind of just dragging this on, I don't know why. Uh the hood, I mean it's really soft. Like I noticed that um I do want to say that it's it's really soft compared to the other box logos that I have, this one's like probably the softest that I've got. This is like more of like a, uh, again, it's a thicker fleece. It's it's more of a winter fleece compared to the other ones, um, which are a little bit of a thinner fleece. This one's, yeah, it's, it's just, a, it's a dope hoodie. I would pick it up if you, uh, if you were looking for it, but yeah. Okay, so I'm done rambling on right now. Again, just give you the close up of the, the box logo right quick. There we go.